guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to just do a quick little haul and yeah, just without further ado, I only went to two stores. I went to Ulta and Bath and Body Works and I have two products here from Ulta. Anyways, that I got a couple weeks ago, but I just wanted to show you guys just comes to make it a little bit longer, I guess. I don't know. Why do we do anything? Anyways, um, and these two just kind of coincide with each other. I got them kind of for each other. Well, no, I got this, this brush for this product. But I got the Real Techniques Setting Brush. And this is just a, like, for under eye concealer. Like, setting that. And then I got the Bare Minerals Concealer in Well Rested. And I use this on, like, special occasions and stuff. And I just want to look a little bit nicer and stuff. And I take more time to do my makeup. Not, like, for school where I'm, like, <laughs> rushing to do it at 5 in the morning and stuff. But... Um, I just set my under eye concealer with this, and it looks real nice, in my opinion. It's not fluff. Yeah. And then um, I went shopping um, on Saturday with my best friend Megan, and I got some stuff there at Ulta and at Bath and Body Works and stuff. But um, the first thing I got, um, I just repurchased my Rimmel London Stay Matte Long Lasting Pressed Powder in color 001 Transparent because I had just run out that day. So I obviously needed more because I don't have any other powders, so yeah. Needed that, got it. And then also that morning I ran him out of my NYX eyebrow pencil in brown and this is what it looks like. And in my opinion, I think that this could rival, if not beat, the Anastasia Brow Wiz. Just saying from like the one time I sampled out the Anastasia Brow Wiz on my hand at a Sephora and stuff, I just was not that impressed with the product. I think it was too hard and dry and that the little like pencil itself was just too small and stuff. It would take forever to do your brows. Um, whereas this has more colors in the line. It's a little bit bigger and stuff, so it's quicker and easier to do your brows as well as being softer and stuff. So it kind of glides in and doesn't like pull out your face and you're like, <clears throat> and stuff. The one thing that the Anastasia Brow Wiz has on this is the spoolie brush at the end. Like, this brush, just, it's a little dinky thing. I don't ever use it. It's lame. Whatever. So the spoolie brush is the one thing that has got it beat. And BT dubs, I plan on filming and uploading a updated um, foundation routine and then a uh, eyebrow routine. Why not? Then, um, in the Isle of Doom, I saw this and had to get it, is the Yes to Cucumbers Soothing Hypoallergenic Facial Towelettes, and this is, uh, the, like, facial towelettes, um, and this is in the packaging that Ingrid, uh, redesigned for Yes to, so I was planning on getting them anyways, just because of Ingrid. And then also, I've just heard lots of good things about these towelettes before, and I wanted to see how they did against my... Um, Kirkland Signature Wipes, because um, I, I just use face wipes now just for my eye makeup, and then I use my Clean and Clear, like, makeup remover oil or whatever it's called on my face. I'll have the review where I reviewed that and a couple other Clean and Clear products linked down below. But yeah, I'm going to do a review on this definitely once I try it out, and I'm really excited to try it out, so... Hopefully that's good. I'm going to use it tonight, probably. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Um, then I got three nail polishes from Essie because I'm a bit of a junkie when it comes to nail polish. And also there was a deal where it was buy to get one free for Essie nail polishes. So, of course I couldn't resist. And the first color I got, the first, the first color I got is from their winter collection, I think. That's what I have on now. And it is Essie's Penny Talk. And this color is gorgeous. Oh my goodness. It's like, looks like just a regular, like, silvery pink sheeny color and stuff. But it's so pretty. Like, you put it on your nails and it's like rose gold kind of. But it like leans more towards the, like, rose part of that gold. But then in sunlight, it's like pure like bronzy gold and it's so pretty oh my goodness I love this color and it's so opaque like I did one coat and I could have been done with that but just because I don't want it to chip I do two coats always at least so I know but it was perfect oh my gosh so obsessed with this color already I can tell it's gonna be a favorite of mine 
Then I got this um, kind of mauve pink with sheen. All of these colors happen to have some pink type of base and are all sheeny, shiny colors, but what can I say? I was feeling in that mood. Um, and this kind of makes me think of tinsel and stuff. I don't know. But it's really pretty. I think it's going to be gorgeous for like transitioning from winter to spring. Like that type of nail polish time. It's going to be gorgeous. And stuff. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. But it is the color Demure Vixen. And like it looks really simple but it's so pretty. <laughs> and like I love looking at it in the light. Just being like ah. Oh. Because <laughs> I'm weird like that. But yeah. So I love that. And then I got this lighter like opalescent pink shimmery color and it is East Hampton Cottage and I think this color is going to be gorgeous especially in that summertime like let's get rid of that bland white I have that looks like a uh, white out this is gonna be a replacement this color is gorgeous oh my goodness it's perfect and I think it'll look so pretty if I try to do French like a French manicure makes me excited to want to try to do that because I don't know how well I can do that I'm learn I'm working on my nail polishing skills anyway then the next place I went to was Bath and Body Works and um, I went and so on Saturday only they had a uh, like their lotions were on sale for three dollars which is an awesome sale oh my heavens yeah, so I got one lotion for myself and then one for my cousin for Christmas. So Samantha, turn off YouTube right now. I see you dawdling, just trying to see what your present is, but do it! Turn it off! Anyway, um, so what I got for her is Country Chic, and I love this scent. I would get this for myself. It's so so pretty and summery smelling and since she lives in Arizona it's gonna be perfect because it's summer there year round let's get real um and just because I'm not very good at describing this but like just my first impression scent for this is I pick up a little bit of a citrus scent to it and just a warm summery scent it's very nice but it also is very clean smelling and stuff um and they describe it as this effortlessly sexy scent is a bright blend of sparkling lemon, marigold and marigold and golden sunflower with a subtle glow of orange blossom and amber wood. So, yeah, it's so nice smelling. Then the lotion that I got for myself and the last item on this haul is Sea Cotton. Oh no, is Sea Island Cotton, and this scent is just so clean and refreshing smelling like oh, this is one of my favorite scents and I haven't even like had this for like two days like that's how good of a scent this is it is just oh, it just makes you think of like a beach house or something you know like oh, where it's like clean but slightly oceany and just really like lots of linens and light and stuff you know and they describe it as this refreshing scent is an airy blend of crisp white cotton, clean linen, and fresh orange blossom woven with a blue freesia and ocean musk. Yes. Just yes. <sighs> oh my goodness. Anyways, that's all that I've got for you guys today. I'm sorry about not uploading last week. Um, I just ran out of time to edit and then when I went to edit I had somehow lost all my footage. It was kind of a crazy weekend for me though because my sister had her second baby so what can I say? Family stuff got in the way but it's okay. I'll be good from now on and start uploading back on my schedule. I promise. I promise that's... Yeah that's what you do. Okay. Anyways uh, I will see you guys I will see you guys next Monday. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. Goodbye.